we were here in our home, my husband and I, um, prior to Hurricane Katrina. But had we not been here, our neighbors that were on either side of us had single story homes. Um, and you know, there was a possibility that, that something could have happened to both of them, but we made both of their families come over to our house, so we all rode the storm out here in our house since we have a two-story. And we kept watching the water, and I kept praying, you know, God, please, please don't let the water, you know, get in the upstairs. But as we watched, you know, and it, it kept, you know, creeping up the next step and the next step and the next step until we were in ankle-deep water upstairs. At that point, I looked at my husband and I said, are we going to make it out of this? And, you know, neither one of us were sure at that time. So we called our children and basically said our goodbyes. And I really, at that point, lost it. Um, and I was sitting in the, the spare room and I started praying. I just really prayed hard, God, please help this water to recede. Um, and I just kept praying that over and over and over again. Um, and there was a picture that I had up in the area that we were at that was on the wall and it was a lighthouse and the seas were, were all churned around it. The storm was going on and the scripture um, on that picture said that, you know, in God I have put my trust, you know, whom, whom shall I fear? And so I kind of had a peace at that point, you know, that God is in control of the winds and He's in control of the waves. I knew that everything was in His hands. Had it not been our faith in God, you know, we probably would have walked away and, and just given up like a lot of people did. But we stood on that scripture that it's not His plan to harm us, but to prosper us and to do us good. And that's what got us through, was our faith in God and, and our family and friends. Would you stand in his presence and join us? Majesty, sing it together. Here we go. 